New tonight, a state lawmaker is working on a bill that would create uniform school summer vacation from Memorial Day to Labor Day across the state. He says it'll help workforce developments for students who are working summer jobs, but his plan is raising some eyebrows. Our Malik Rankin joins us now with what the concerns are. Good evening, Sherry. This bill was drafted by Representative Steve Hurst, and it gives students a 15-week summer break spanning from Memorial Day to Labor Day. And while the legislation is still in its early stages, it's already raising red flags for some teachers. Some parents are concerned this would mean other breaks during the school year would be shortened, school days would be longer, or that child care would become costly if summer is extended. Representative Hurst is assuring people this is not the case. He says the time could be made up by extending school days by less than 30 minutes. I spoke with the Birmingham Teachers Union to get their take on the potential new bill. So when they make these blanket statements, it sounds good. But if they really talk to the educators on the ground um, and, and the parents, um, I, I understand it's also about trying to make more money uh, at the Gulf Coast. So that's, they'll talk about all that and for, for tax revenues. But I, I think they need to leave that alone and have conversations with the school system. I think that's an excellent idea. I love that. I feel like children do need a longer break. They need more time to be kids and to spend time with their families. The Birmingham Teachers Union said they'll be keeping an eye out for this bill to learn more about how it can affect our schools in the long run. The bill has not yet been introduced to this legislative session. Representative Hurst is inviting parents and school leaders to talk to him about the bill and have a seat at the table. Live in studio, I'm Malik Rankin, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.